So, Mrs. Beatty, you're looking for an exciting place for your next vacation. I usually travel to major cities in Europe, but this time I want to go someplace different, someplace away from the city, as long as it's safe. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Ah, how about California? The Big Sur area is spectacular. California has lots of earthquakes, doesn't it? Well, they have earthquakes occasionally, but not very often. But it does have earthquakes. Yes. I'm not going. Okay. How about some place in Asia, a beach in Thailand? Kochang has beautiful beaches, and it's very quiet there. A quiet beach sounds nice. But they said on the news there's a monsoon in Thailand. <laughs> but the monsoon will be over by the time you go. What else can you recommend? Australia. The Australian outback is amazing. I've heard they have tornadoes in Australia. <laughs> Some parts. Where else? Jamaica. Hurricanes. South Africa. Floods. Hawaii. Landslides. You know a lot about natural disasters, don't you, Mrs. Beatty? Let's see. What about Finland? Finland? It's wild, beautiful, and very different from other parts of Europe. And nothing bad ever happens in Finland. Finland sounds good. I'll go to Finland. <laughs> Great. I'll book your tickets. <laughs> okay. I just booked your tickets to Helsinki, Finland. You'll be staying at the Palace Hotel. That's great. Excuse me, Mr. Evans. Yes, Marie. Mr. Woods is on the phone. He told me to tell you it's urgent. Urgent? He's traveling, you know. Yes. He said there's some kind of epidemic. What kind of epidemic? It sounds like it's that new influenza. But he was vaccinated for that before he left. I know, but he told me to tell you that he wants to fly home today. On the internet, it says only three people are sick. That is not an epidemic. And it's not like anybody's dying from this flu. He said he didn't want to be the first. <laughs> Where is he traveling, may I ask? He's in Finland. Finland? I just booked tickets to Finland. Mrs. Beatty, everything will be fine. You'll get vaccinated and you'll have nothing to worry about. I'm not going to Finland. You told me nothing bad ever happens in Finland. Mrs. Beatty, I can't think of anywhere in the world you can go and be completely safe. Right here in this city, you could go outside and get hit by a bus. But you can't let that stop you from doing the things you want to do. <laughs> Look, why don't we go to lunch and we'll talk it over. <laughs> I don't think she's going anywhere. Dining alone? Uh, Paul and Marie went to get newspapers. Do you mind if I join you? Oh, please, sit down. May I ask what you're reading? Um... <laughs> A History of the World. <laughs> the bestseller? I'm very impressed. Reading nonfiction over lunch? I hear that it's a very difficult book. Uh... No, it's... It's a pretty easy read. I... I can't put it down, actually. <laughs> a real page-turner, huh? Do you think that I could borrow it when you're done? Sure. I usually prefer fiction myself. You know, thrillers, mysteries. 
There's nothing like curling up with a good science fiction novel, is there? <laughs> you read science fiction too? <laughs> Don't tell anyone. Are you learning a lot from your book? Uh, yeah, I think so. So, tell me what you're reading about right now. Um, this part is about Great Britain. <laughs> really? Do you mind if I take a look? <laughs> Cheryl hates when I read comics. Then I can understand why you can't put the book down. <laughs> you think that I could borrow it then? Well, I'm still reading this one, but I have another one I can loan you. I meant this one. Oh. Help yourself. السلام عليكم لا تنسوا الاعجاب بالفيديو والاشتراك في القناه تشجيعا لنا لنستمر بنشر المزيد ان شاء الله